Ladies and gentlemen, Tulsa, Oklahoma specifically, we are back here on SmackDown. Uh, well, welcome back. We're still relatively early on the show here. We just kicked things off a couple minutes ago with Carmella retaining the SmackDown Women's Championship against Liv Morgan. Truly a great way to open up the show. And of course, in tonight's main event, fail four-way match where the winner will face off against Jinder Mahal for his Intercontinental Championship at one night stand Extreme Rules in four weeks' time. That fail for main event will be between Kane, Dolph Ziggler, Rusev, and well, former Intercontinental Champion who lost it back at main event week two to Jinder Mahal in Shinsuke Nakamura. But before we get to that, well, we have this matchup underway. Kevin Owens, fresh off a of victory from last week, Defeating Sin Cara and well the quickest matchup in numerous month history so far a little bit under I I believe it was under two minutes If I wasn't mistaken And well Owens here and now he faces off against a man You know who's had a good roll of momentum across the past couple weeks that man ladies and gentlemen is as the back Now of course black he did come up short at mind the bank a couple of nights ago But he has a yeah, well, he has an opportunity to bounce back after that. He was getting a couple of string of victories. He was getting some high moments for himself. Of course, if anything, probably SmackDown's favorite to win the Money in the Bank ladder match. You know, he did look better than Buddy Murphy, Andrade, and Finn Balor last week on SmackDown. Before Money in the Bank, he stood tall over all three of them. All three of them were laid out, scattered across the floor and the ring mat. And Black was the only one standing. However, he did come up short at Mind the Bank. But 24 hours prior to Mind the Bank, he picked up a victory over Eric Rowan. Even with the interference, the botched interference of anything, from Daniel Bryan. But once again, Black has an opportunity to bounce back from the loss here tonight. In this matchup against Kevin Owens. And Owens, of course, after his matchup against Sin Cara last week, he did say, Mark his words. Kevin Owens will be WWE Champion by WrestleMania. So Owens definitely has his sights set on the WWE title. No surprise there to be fair. But Owens making it loud and clearly known to the SmackDown roster. Sin Cara was just an example, at least to the terms of Kevin Owens. Can Black be Owens' second example? No event thing I like to think. Black is not going to take that too lightly. He's not going to let Owens get the best of him here at night. Definitely one of those power rankings matchups. If anything, every matchup leads to momentum. But these two, they're kind of neck and neck. You know, they'll definitely be even wise of rankings with, this, with the star power that they possess. Whether that be closer to the Yurinkano Tau or the WWE Tau. And of course, well, Asia and Biggie, he will appear later on tonight to explain his actions to as of why. He basically betrayed his own New Day brother in Xavier Woods. But of course, that's later on tonight. Right here, right now, is this matchup. Second matchup of the night. Truly, it's going to be a good one. Has to be. Surely, it will. It's ass Black. It's Kevin Owens. And it starts right now. And now, here we go. Black initiates the collar and elbow of anything. But Owens now going to overpower Black into the corner. And now here we go. Will we get a clean, uh, well, clean break? Obviously not. With Kevin Owens. No, what a knee. Big time knee strike. That one rocks Owens. Makes him crumble down off his feet. And now look at this. The striking ability of Aspect. Those dangerous kicks. Looks for another knee. Misses it. And Owens looks to get something off of it here. But not going to be able to. And now Aspect Black right there. Big time suplex. And oh, misses the snap mare. Owens sensed it, gets out the way, and now KO here. Oh, look at this sunset flip. Variation of sorts of anything. And now Kevin Owens with the high ground. Charges that as Black to captates him with that clothesline. And kick to the chest for good measure as well. And now it's Kevin Owens here with the upper hand on as Black. Black had a good show in early on with those strikes, but now Owens, he's looking to have a good show of his own. Big time. Kick to a midsection. Misses the strike. 
Black Hero sides the better. Now here we go. Once again, those strikes of Astro Black, ladies and gentlemen, the knee right there to top it off. Just the cherry on top of a good Sunday, if anything. And now Black charges up. Oh. Misses that form in the corner. Gets the knee to a temple. And now Black with the upper hand on Kevin Owens. Still in the relative early stages of this matchup. Who knows, maybe one of these two men, depending on who he wins his matchup, could even appear on One Night Stand Extreme Rules. Where if it's a tile match or not. But I guess we shall see. Now look at this Falcon Arrow off the top rope already. As the Black pulling out all stops here. Owens in the center of the ring. He's dazed. And now Black here. Double foot stop. And it connects. And now Black quickly crawling into the pin here. Can he be able to have it? Can he have Kevin Owens here? No. Owens gets the shoulder up. And Black staying on the offensive. Off the ropes. Gets him right there. Springboard moonsault. Connects on to Kevin Owens. And that's back on the row as SmackDown continues. Back here live on SmackDown's during the break as Black connecting with Big Time Meteor to be able to stay on Kevin Owens to stay with the momentum in this matchup and now oh look at that springboard kick and now and springboard moonsault just for some extra measure well like I did say Ash Black the Meteor making him stay on Kevin Owens making him you know have the upper hand to put into better words that's now Owens here. He's looking for something. After he got out of harm's way from the double foot. Oh, what a strike right there. That one rocks Black onto one knee. And now Owens here. Looking for it here. Can he be able to get it? Pop a power bomb. Yes, no. No, he can't get it. Black able to reverse with a Frankensteiner. And now Aster Black. Has Owens where he wants him. Owens using the ropes to his advantage here. And now Aster Black now. Going to use the ropes to his assistance, if anything, and oh, Falcon Arrow. Bouncing Owens off the ropes. That's using the environment right there. That's using your environment, if anything. That's now Black. Calls Owens up to his feet. Oh, Owens. Papa Parbum. Getting reversed. Owens looking for Papa Parbum right, relatively early on, if you ask me. No, Springboard Knee right there. Connects flush on the Kevin Owens. Well, the Papa Parbum was a missed attempt. But will the Black Mask be able to connect? No, it won't. Owens catches him. No power bomb. Well, KO can't. Eh, well, he's not able to connect with power, power bomb. And Black is not going to be able to connect with the Black Mask. Both men 0 for 1 for their best maneuvers. As now Black, he assuming gets dumped to the outside for his troubles. And now it's Kevin Owens here. As the referee now initiates the count of 10. Owens now. Just bringing Black over onto the announce table. Luckily enough, once again, I have the broadcast booth like always. And Owens has my fireman's care position here. What can I be looking for here? No, just dumps Astro Black onto the le the desk, especially Lesk. Pretty sure it's not a word. But onto the tabletop, if anything. And Kevin Owens using the announce table's advantage here. Of course, has the referee's 10 count to look out for. And Black, he's helpless against it. As now Owens brings us Black in, into the ring. Back into the ring, venting. And now KO. Scale into the top rope, the high red district. And now here we go. Black calls Owens. Now Owens. Venting. Owens calls Black up to his feet. And now Kevin Owens was looking for a crossbar, but he gets caught. Aster Black catches him. What strength into a power bomb? The strength of Aster Black being showcased to lift up a man that size compared to your own. Aster Black showing that he doesn't lack in the strength department. As now, oh, here we go. Big time closed on a second one. And KO. The leg is caught and then followed by sweeping off said leg by Aster Black. He's on a roll here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Truly a great performance on his part, but Owens, he's not going to take that line down. Or maybe he is, because if anything, Black, he's had an answer for almost every one 
of KO's maneuvers so far in this contest. Oh, what a high kick. Oh, and he able to connect with that knee to a midsection. Black gonna roll out. And now, oh, those striking. That striking game, the striking ability once again being showcased here by Astro Black. Oh, the leg gets caught. And now Kevin Owens here had the opportunity to do something, but his legs get caught. Oh, Jesus! And KO just got knocked out right there. Alistair Black, those dangerous legs, those dangerous kicks. Owens has barely had an answer for any of them. That's now Black here, jumping over hip, and Black Mats! Ducks underneath, jumps over, followed by the Black Mats. Kevin Owens, I think he's out cold fully this time around. Ladies and gentlemen, Astro Black, what a victory here at night, no! Well, it's not one just yet. If it even is going to be one for Astro Black. A kick out at two. Kevin Owens survives the Black Mass. He's still in it. And Black trying to use, well, the the people in attendance here to his advantage. Gets a double foot stop and Owens just going to immediately roll out. And Owens gets brought back in. Trying to bait out to Black, but no, Black was not fond for it right there. And now uh, Astro Black here. Once again, high red, but no. Owens trying to stir back up to his feet here. Black, he's waiting for him here now. Astro Black, oh, misses the spinning heel kick. Owens sidesteps it. Finally gets a moment to breathe here, does Kevin Owens. And now Dragon, the body of Black. Against the ropes here, KO charges it up, what a clothesline to the outside, goes the ominous man from Amsterdam. And Black is now in trouble. Owens here looking for something, once again Black has an answer to it. And oh, just a big time kick. Close to being the Black Mask, but doesn't get the full rotation. Not as devastating as the Black Mask, still devastating in its own right. But you know, just not as... Not as good as the Black Mask, but still will knock you silly. As well as knock Kevin Owens silly, if anything. That's now Owens here. Oh, is this on the outside? Here, no, against the knee. Skull, the back of the skull, back of the neck area. Across the knee of Kevin Owens. And Owens here, on the ring apron. Calls Black up, back to his feet. What is, what is KO planning here? Well, Black, if anything, is dazed once again. Back of the head, back of the neck area. We'll do stuff like that to you. No. Black perhaps playing possum, perhaps baited him. No, DDT onto the outside. The unforgiven thin layer of padding. Yes, it is protected, but you know, it's a very thin layer of anything. Doesn't really break the fall all that much. As now Owens here just gonna get launched back inside the ring. Black has had enough of the outside atmosphere of anything. Wants to take things back to the ring where he's most comfortable to use those ropes to his advantage. Which I'm pretty sure he's about to do right now. Here we go. Springboard knee. No. Owens gets out of the way. Looks for a headbutt. And he just put his head straight into the lines. Then Black Mask. KO. He's still in it though. Kevin Owens is still alive. And that's Black. He's livid. He's irate. He does not believe it. Just stomping, repeated stomps on it. Kevin Owens and Owens is back up. Owens is back up. Kevin Owens is back up. Headbutt following the forearm strike. But Black, he could also hit pretty hard. But no, oh, big time near across the temple. And Owens and Black reversing the storm here. Owens gets sent to the corner. And now Owens sends back to a corner big time close nine. And now Kevin Owens finally able to get an upper hand here for the last couple moments or not. Spoke too soon. Commentators curse. Or maybe not. These two men, they have an answer for every one of each other's moves. Every man reversing one another. Owens here. Desperation cover. That's got to be desperation. And it sure is. Owens can't believe it, and now off the ropes goes Astro Black here. Oh, misses the knee! Misses the knee! Kevin Owens! Kevin Owens! God Sam, no he doesn't! Pop-up powerbomb is reversed once more. And now Black, he has Owens now of anything. 
Here we go! Slice the throat, followed by a strike. Knocks Owens. Silly! Is this it? No, it's not. It's only two, and Owens is back up again. Kevin Owens. He's probably saying, the only way to keep me down is to kill me. Has to be Jesus. What a close line. That one, for sure. Decapitates as the Black sends his head launched into the fourth row, but Black is back up. Owens cannot believe it, but he's staying on Black. He's not going to stay too astonished for long. He knows he has to stay on as the Black, and Black knows the same of Kevin Owens. Well, clearly, as yes, this matchup has already shown. I believe it's been two Black masses so far, and Owens has gone out of all of them. As now Owens here versus Black, and oh! Takes him down with the suplex. But Ash Black Mini springs back up off the ropes. He goes, gets the springboard moonsault to connect. Down goes Kevin Owens. And now Ash Black here. I can't be thinking of now just going to drag Owens away from the ropes here. And now, once again, high risk, high reward in the mind of Ash Black. Double foot stop, it's missed. Owens sends it, gets out of the way big time for him. That one rocks as Black. And now, oh, Black here sweeps out the leg. Lowers Kevin Owens to sweep him out. Oh, misses the spinning knee, gets the elbow, but Owens now reverses. And oh, big time shoulder tackle. Down goes Astro Black. And Kevin Owens calls him up to his feet. It's Kevin Owens now who's on the offensive here. Looking to put an end to Astro Black in this matchup the torture rack into the neck breaker into the cover now can this be it for Kevin Owens no not even a one count and Owens he's now irate he now can't believe it multiple stomps across the body of Astro Black similar to what Black did to Owens a couple minutes ago when Black couldn't believe Owens resiliency as now oh Big time close line right there by Kevin Owens and Black. Gonna have to take a brief run to the outside. First time in this matchup that Black has basically retreated. That's now KO. Oh no, Black immediately gets back inside the ring. I think he heard me. Trying to prove me, trying to prove me wrong here. If anything, you know. Oh, misses that shot right there. And Owens takes him down with the shoulder tackle once more. KO now. What can't be thinking of? Hero! Sunset flip this time. It goes into the pin. Compared to previously earlier on in the matchup where Owens did not immediately get the pinfall. But Vente, to no avail. As Black, is looking for something, gets reversed. And now KO. Black now. Can Owens of anything. As Black up against the ropes here. And KO. Oh no. Sends him, just dumps him to the outside here. Black will harsh landing. And Kevin Owens here, he has that look in his eye. A look where he wants to pull away. As the Black for good. A pop up power bomb onto the ring apron. You know, usually I would say it's unnecessary. But I think by this point, by this point, judging on how this matchup has gone, I feel like it's completely 100% necessary. Alistair Black has not stood down at all. Kevin Owens, he wants to make Black stay down for three counts. And I think he's finally done it. No, he hasn't. Alistair Black, it's still, he's still alive. He's still alive and kicking. And Kevin Owens, Kevin Owens, is he going to walk out? I do not blame this man if he does so. Black's already back on his feet. And Owens, he's getting a chair. And oh, Black gonna stop him. Gets the knee across the back. And oh, oh look at this. As Black brings a steel chair into the ring. I feel like Black won't actually use this. It would probably be more of a case to lure Kevin Owens back inside the ring. Because at this point, Owens, I feel like he just wants to end this. And now Black toying around with Kevin Owens. Con Owens back inside the ring here. And Owens follows into a Black Mass. He just got lured into the ring. Astro Black, ladies and gentlemen. What a genius maneuver. But it's not going to do him any good. And Black, he now cannot believe it. He's a, he was about to stoop to the level of Kevin Owens. He was about to use the steel chair. 
But the referee gonna stop Black from doing it. Snatches it out of his hand, takes it out of the ring, and now that's the Black here from our Black Mass. It's caught. It's caught into a power bomb. Oh, Jesus. Black's head bouncing off that bottom rope. That's an easy head injury of some sorts right there. The neck is not supposed to bounce that way. Especially off a surface such as the ropes. Kevin Owens. Taking down Ashley Black right there. Owens deciding against, against getting another weapon. Realizes the chair's on the outside. And well, Owens, I guess he's going to try to use his, the most to his advantage. Gut buster right there. But Owens follows his up shortly after. Oh, a cannonball. Just, well, if anything, it's senton, if anything. Launches his body across Astro Black's. And now, oh, Samoan drop him. The lower legs of Astro Black gets caught up on that chair. Not as effective as Kevin Owens perhaps wanted it to be. But still able to get somewhat of a connection. And, well, if anything, that is not a disqualification. Owens did not use the chair with his own bare hands. He, technically, he is using it, but not with his bare hands. It's not grabbing it or anything. Just using it like you would for like the turnbuckle of anything. That's now Astro Black here. Oh, the referee was in the way. Well, in the range of fire is the referee. That's now Kevin Owens here. Oh, what? Owens launches the referee into the corner. Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens steal chair. And the referee turns around. He missed it. The referee does not suspect a thing. He does not suspect a thing. And now Black missed the kick stunner. Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens under the referee's nose picks up the victory. At the end of the day, the steel chair shot that Owens. That's what Owens needed. At the end of the day, not the Papa Power Bomb, but a steel chair. And the legal weapon. Into the matchup as well, Owens needed. He sent the referee into the corner. The referee was dazed. And Owens, away from the referee's point of view, uses the steel chair into the gut of Astro Black. Drops it just in time before the referee can get his bearings. Drops it before the referee can get his bearings. Followed by the stunner and the three count. Ladies and gentlemen, that man right there, Kevin Owens, is victorious. In one hell of a hard fought matchup. That matchup was mostly Astro Black, if you ask me. But Kevin Owens, at the end of the day, under the referee's nose, with the victory.